Later, can you believe this? He is back on his feet. In an all-new interview, Kevin Ware's mother tells us how he's doing. But take a look at this minion. Cute. Remember this part in the movie? You're so fluffy. <laughs> the good thing is this snake is a friendly snake, and you really have to be careful this time of the year because this is a gopher snake, but it actually resembles a rattlesnake. Yeah. These days, kids, they're not checking snail mail. They're using Facebook, Twitter, and all you got to do is just post that. Well, you've probably heard of pacemakers used to help your heart, but did you know they can help treat parts? Parkinson's. Doctor, thank you so You're much welcome. for being here with us. Thank you. I'm going to toss it over to April now for a look at our weather, mm -hmm. and we were just talking allergies, and you're saying yeah. today is not a good day for allergy sufferers, right? You grab me, I go like this, right. hit you, exactly, and, going, and then punch you. Perfect. How does that feel? How does that, that feel? Good. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Tickets are $5, but if you go to any high health in the valley, they you can just pick them up there for free. So anyway, what do you think about my moves? I thought you were going to make him talk okay. at a high-pitched voice for a second. <laughs> at least you hit the target. Well, gosh, you're yeah, only right? six feet away. <laughs> there you go. Hey! There you go. I did it. Woo! She's a natural. <laughs> Stella, that yeah. was impressive. Well, the waiting game begins after the U.S. Supreme Court hears arguments regarding two big cases on same-sex marriage. California's Prop 8. A delegation of government and medical officials from South Korea will attend the Korea-Arizona Trauma Summit today in Phoenix. Well, in the meantime, though, a shakeup inside the Arizona Department of Veterans Services. Now, the woman at the center of it is speaking out. They went missing yesterday, and when they did not return at around 5 p.m., that is when family members called police. So we want to show you some video from earlier this morning. Hanging out with some dinosaurs. Oh yeah, I'm going to show you the dinosaurs in just a second, but I want to show you something else. It's a new craze. It's called yarn bombing. Hi. Check with your local Petco if you want to yeah. adopt a dog. Anyway, spring cleaning, it is a task, but someone's got to do it. And so in this case, make sure you think about your pets as well. Back to you guys. Sniffling and sneezing a lot lately. Trust me, you're not alone. A lot of people are suffering from allergies, but they can be prevented. Dr. Art Mullen is here to explain. Doctor, good morning. Thank you for being good here Good morning. With us. Great to be here. So really, yeah. it can be prevented? 90 new stores will open their doors at 9 this morning. And over the next few days, you can enjoy special savings and free gifts at select stores. You can also enter to win a $250 gift card. We'll have a live report coming up later this morning. And Arizona Senator Jeff Flake is planning to spend part of his summer on a deserted island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Cool. Yeah, but you know what? This is not the first time he's done this. These are pictures from his last solo trip in 2009. He lived off of the island for a week and lost 10 pounds. That's a diet. Yeah, yeah that's one way to do it. <laughs> so to combat loneliness, he reportedly counted hermit crabs and even had favorites. Flake tells congressional newspaper The Hill that he'll take his children this time around, and he plans to keep them entertained by uh, spearing fish and cracking coconuts Gosh. might be a good learning experience for the kids, you sure. know, to disconnect from the cell phones, from the iPads and all that stuff. So might be fun.